My name is A.P. Boydell. Some people call me Dutch. Way back in the 1940s, I worked in Michigan for the Dow Chemical Company. The management wanted to build a plant along the Gulf Coast, so they sent me down to Texas to find a suitable location. I narrowed the choices to Corpus Christi and Freeport. I selected Freeport and the construction began. You can see parts of the plant when you drive to Surfside Beach. You can see the company's new, modern office building near downtown Lake Jackson. The red diamond is Dow's logo. Dow makes many products that you see every day, like toothpaste tubes, the foam and sneakers, and styrofoam cups. When people were hired at the plant near Freeport, a big problem developed. Many of the workers had no place to live. So, I got this grand idea. Why not build a brand new city? An architect named Alden B. Dow and I surveyed the land surrounding the plant looking for the perfect spot. We decided on a beautiful area covered in trees that had been part of a sugar and cotton plantation. We began to clear the land, very careful to leave as many trees standing as possible. Oak Drive was the first street built in the new town that we named Lake Jackson. My wife Belle and I lived in this house next to the lake behind Target. I raised cattle there and loved to ride my horse Lucille. I gave some of my calves to 4-H students so that they could show them at the county fair. One of my hobbies was cutting and polishing rocks. You could say that I was a rock hound. I was also very supportive of the Boy Scouts of America. They presented me with this Silver Beaver Award. Are any of you Boy Scouts or Girl Scouts? A final word. I want to invite you and all of you to visit the Historical Museum in downtown Lake Jackson to learn more about me, A.P. Boydell.